killed for their tusks. Illegal poaching is at its most serious in decades, largely because of soaring demand for ivory in Asia. This is why it's so valuable. Now in government hands, this batch of carefully carved jewelry and figurines was destined to be sold to Chinese buyers who want to publicly express their newly acquired wealth. Over the past four decades, customs officers in Hong Kong have confiscated tens of millions of dollars worth of ivory, mostly from Kenya and Tanzania, en route to mainland China. The conservation groups say that this represents only a tiny fraction of the illegal trade in this part of the world. To combat illicit trafficking, the government has begun to burn its entire stockpile of contraband ivory. After being chopped into small pieces, they're placed in these drums and incinerated at high heat. Over the next year or so, almost 30 tons will be destroyed. Officials say they want to send a strong signal against the illegal trade. Today is not a celebration, but a solemn reminder of the tragedy that so many elephants have been illegally killed solely for the market value of their task. 